you guys was commenting I need to redo my headliner in my Cherokee. So that's what we're going to be doing today. Stay tuned. So you can see the headliner in this thing is trash. It's coming down. It's just falling down. And it's just not very good on the eyes when you got the window down. So let's go ahead and uh, rip this down. And uh, go ahead and begin scraping all this nice glue off. So basically all you do is take all your trim off around. You take your sun visors off. And I got this piece off. I'm going to go over and grab that piece and pull it off. But you just take all your trim off around here. Now I'm not going to take the shock off because the hatch will hit me in the back of the head. So I'm just going to pull this down like this. And just kind of prop it up like that. And that will give me enough room to grab this. As you can see it's already coming loose all right we finally got it down a lot of people take these off right here but you don't have to you can pry it out a little bit and this thing will drop if you can get it to drop on one side you're good but it's out now unplug everything the dome lights are out you gotta take those out too take your speakers out their torx bit also leave your speaker bar hang up there as you can see it just kind of it just hangs there it's kind of weird but the, i got that stuff all over me here's how bad it really is it's pretty bad. I'm gonna take a hard bristle brush and just scoop all this off the fiberglass, peel all this back, and then we're gonna paint it, clean all this up with the brush, we'll be good to go. All right, well, this is what it looks like when it's all scraped off. However you wanna do it, this is the cheap way to do it, to paint it or whatever. Uh, we're just experimenting with it. It ain't got to be perfect. It's just a, a Jeep that I mud in. Basically, I just used spray paint. It actually turned out really good. Satin spray paint. Um, it's not perfect, but it looks a lot better than it did. This is uh, what I used. Looks uh, pretty good. It's kind of dark now. It's hard to see. But uh, it's black. I kept the tan accents and lights and everything still work. Um, I think it looks a lot better. Um, I like it black. Uh, it's it would hold up, and I only spent ten bucks to do it. It took me about four hours taking this stuff out, scraping all the old glue off, and then prepping the surface and then spray painting it. Like I showed you, I, I bought those two big tall cans that cost about 10 bucks. So I painted this for 10 bucks. That's all it cost me to do it. A lot of people will rhino line it, which it looks really, really good, uh, which I'll probably do in the future. But honestly, this actually looks pretty good the way it is. Um, I'm pretty impressed with it. There's some spray paint lines in it, but it's no big deal. Uh, I went with satin, but it's a lot better than having that stuff hang down in your way. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. It was short and simple and straight to the point, and it's super easy to do. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Give it a thumbs up. I'm Cherokee Ronnie. Stay dirty, my friends.